In this video we're going to look at how to find the surface area of a cuboid. So here's a cuboid and obviously it's got six faces. It's got six rectangular faces, the front, the back, the left hand side, the right hand side, the top and the bottom. So to get the surface area of a cuboid what you've got to do is work out the area of all six of the faces and add them up. Now you may notice that some of them will be the same, for instance the top area will be the same as the area of the bottom face, the area of the left hand face will be the same as the area of the right hand face and so on. Okay, So let's work out the surface area of this cuboid. So for the front, the front you've got 3 by 12 so you do 3 times 12 which is equal to 36 centimetres squared. The back is going to be the same so that's going to be another 36 centimetres squared. The left hand side, this side here, it's 3 high and Obviously, looking at the length, it's going to be 10 long, okay? So it's going to be 3 times 10. So 3 times 10 equals 30 centimetres squared. So the left-hand face would be 30 centimetres squared. The right-hand face would be exactly the same, so that's another 30 centimetres squared. Let's now look at the bottom. The bottom's 12 by 10, so you're going to do 12 times 10 for the bottom. So that's 120 centimetres squared. And the top's going to be exactly the same, so it's another 120 centimetres squared. And then finally, what you've got to do is <coughs> just add them all up. If you just add up all those um, areas, then you get the area, because you've got all six faces there. You just add them all up, and that's the total surface area. So we're just going to do 36 plus 36 plus 30 plus 30 plus 120 plus 120. And press equals. So the surface area, the total surface area of this cuboid is... 372 centimetres squared. Notice the units because it's surface area, it's centimetres squared. Okay, so let's have a look at another uh, cuboid and work out the surface area of it. So this time we've got the height is 2 centimetres, the width is 3 centimetres, and the depth is 3 centimetres. So we've got a rectangle on the front, a rectangle on the right hand side, and the left hand side, and a rectangle on the back. The top would be 3 by 3, so the top's actually going to be a square, and the bottom's going to be a square. So, <coughs> Let's work out the surface area. So the area of the front, the front's going to be 2 by 3. So we're going to do 2 times 3, which equals 6 centimetres squared. So that's for the front. So the back's going to be exactly the same. So the back's going to be 6 centimetres squared as well. The right-hand side, well, the right-hand side is 3 centimetres by 2 centimetres. So that's going to be, again, 2 times 3. Uh, it's going to be 6 centimetres squared. And the left-hand side would be exactly the same. But actually worthwhile <clears throat> writing down what you're working out. So this is the front, this is the back, this is the right hand side, this is the left hand side, and then let's do the top. So the top's going to be 3 by 3, so 3 times 3 equals 9 centimetres squared, that's the top, and then another 9 centimetres squared for the bottom. That way you can check that you've got all six of the all six of the uh, faces, and then you just need to add them up. So six plus six is twelve, eighteen, twenty-four, thirty-three, forty-two. So the total surface area is forty-two centimeters squared.